Many in the LGBTQ community feel under attack just as a month designed to celebrate Pride gets started. Thanks for joining us. I'm Tracy Hutchins. And I'm Alan Devlin. Atlanta News First Patrick Quinn is live in Midtown where the new Atlanta Pride director shared his vision. So Patrick, uh, excuse me. Yeah, Patrick, what do you have to say? Yeah, well, I was able to just sit down with him and a reminder to anyone watching who's new to Atlanta. Yes, today is the start of Pride Month, but the parade here to Atlanta is not till October. And of course, that parade goes right along here in Midtown where roughly 500,000 people, they party on the streets. And this year, there's a new leader. Pride Month is here. Atlanta's Pride Parade is still four months away with a new executive director, Chris McCain. I mean, I think Pride is important every year and it's especially critical this year. I sat down with the new face of the Pride Parade who told me this year's theme is show up and show out. The parade annually draws nearly 400,000 people. And after recent legislation, both in Georgia and across the South, threatening the rights of those in the LGBTQ community, McCain said being visible and vocal is critical, with a reminder that pride started as a protest. And so I think it's really important that we remember that first, pride is about resistance and about um, working towards justice and equal rights for all people, especially the queer community. In March, Governor Brian Kemp signed a bill that bans most gender affirming care for transgender children. McCain said even during planning, they're working to prioritize the trans community and really make sure that we're featuring them and elevating their needs um, given the, the attacks that they've experienced and the, um, the real fear that many in the trans community are facing right now. The largest pride parade in the South and one of the largest in the country. McCain knows many look to Atlanta as a model of inclusion. And Chris told me that they cannot do it alone. Right now they're calling on volunteers as well as donors to uh, give money to the Atlanta Pride Parade. For more information there, you can go to atlantapride.org. Also this weekend, there's an Atlanta Pride 5K. It's in Piedmont Park. It is sponsored by Atlanta News First. I'll be there as well as some other reporters and anchors for our station. That's on Sunday morning. We're live from Midtown. Patrick Quinn, Atlanta News First. Should be great weather for it. Patrick, thank you. Let's